It is February 13th, 2021. It is your boy, Proven Winner, a.k.a. P-Dub, coming at you with another NBA free winner. But first, let's review yesterday's absolute blowout winner with the New York Knicks visiting the Washington Wizards. As stated yesterday, the New York Knicks defense absolutely locked up the Wiz without Bradley Beal. And just, they couldn't do anything on the offensive end of the floor. Uh, truly impressive performance by the Knicks. 18 point blowout winner. And Derek Rosa stated at a little punch for the bench for the Knicks. And they just took care of business yesterday. So congratulations to everybody that took that free play winner. Our premium package yesterday. Absolute huge day. 4-0 overall. We had the Mavs minus three. Those Knicks minus three, UCSB against Hawaii minus five late night. And we parlayed all three for a 4-0 sweep with a three-team parlay. If you want to jump on the premium play package, I highly suggest it. $99 for the rest of the year. Jump over to the website, www.provenwinner.net. Grab yourself a premium play package and try our service for a heavily reduced price for $99 for the rest of the year. February. Let's get into that NBA free winner. We've got the Indiana Pacers visiting the Atlanta Hawks at the time of this taping. Indiana currently sitting as a one and a half point favorite total sitting at 225 and a half. Pacers most recently knocked off the Pistons 111-95 on Thursday night. This will be Atlanta's third game in four nights. They had a very difficult contest against the Mavericks on Wednesday night in which they dropped that game by a point. That was very apparent because they got absolutely dismantled by the Spurs last night at home. I mean, it was never a contest from start to finish. You could tell the Hawks were tired from that contest the night or two nights prior against the Mavs. And now they're coming into a back-to-back. -back. Wow. Atlanta Hawks are in trouble. Both teams are uh, injury-plagued at the moment. Pacers currently have Lavert out and TJ Warren Hawks, Bogdanovich, Dunn, and Hunter definitely out tonight. With Rondo questionable, I don't think Rondo will play tonight. He's been out the last two games with some pain in the lower back. Looks like he probably will not make tonight's contest as well, which is even more trouble for the Hawks. Let's get into some of the trends. Pacers 11-3 in their last 15 road games against a team with a home losing record. Also 12-4. ATS in their last 16 as a road favorite. Hawks come in one and four ATS in their last five. I mean, everything points to the Pacers tonight. This line is far too small for the situation the Hawks are in, being beat up and playing three games in four nights. This game will not even be a contest. I'm telling you guys right now, this game will not be a contest. Pacers win by 10 plus the only margin in which the Hawks have an advantage is in the rebounding category. But here's what I'm thinking. The Hawks are going to miss a lot of shots. The energy level will be low, and this will not be a contest. I could see the Pacers coming in fresh. They've got a 13-13 and -13 record, and they just beat up on the Pistons. I see this as a blowout winner for the Indiana Pacers. Lay the one and a half, and let's cash another ticket. P. Dub Nation. Jump over to the website, provenwinner.net, and grab yourself a premium play package for only $99 for the rest of February.